fighting for so long, I gotta think what satisfies me more now. It's time to do something different. I didn't go lift weights because I wanted to look good and try to get people's attention. There's two things I like doing. It's either practice to take lives and then practice saving lives. It's hard to explain where the desire and the drive comes from because it's always been there. I used to just challenge tough guys I knew and fight guys at bars. That was literally the beginning stages of my fighting. You know, you want to be the badass guy on the motorcycle, shoot dangerous guns. You want to go step in the cage and brawl with somebody they all have their inherent dangers. You have to be a certain type of person to accept that. Let's go, Joel! My whole life encompassed fighting. Fighting is a very selfish sport. You're so self-absorbed in your training, your eating, your regimen. You become almost robotic. I've been through a shitload of injuries, right? I've pretty much hurt all sorts of stuff. Start getting checked out by more doctors, getting more eyes on me then they see that my neck is messed up, my back is messed up, like, everything's messed up. Bad. The one doctor that I had, she's like, you're, you're done. I don't know if you'll ever lift weights again. I built this body for fighting. I gotta think. What satisfies me more now today, and it's probably doing stuff for other people rather than myself. My whole year at the fire department is volunteer. I see how many people in town do so much for the community, it's crazy. Rescue services has been probably the most fulfilling thing I've done. I just see the impact it has on people. Two man piquette, apparatus 24, 202 bar. Once I got into mining, mine rescue seemed like a no brainer. When disaster happens and everyone's trying to get out, you're going in. Especially when I've dedicated so much time to myself, it's great to be out there doing stuff for others. Every morning now, I strap on this pager and it gives me a bit of anxiety that I enjoy. I know that it's there, it's a reminder that everything I'm doing has a purpose and a reason. Who's going to sign up to go deal with a motor vehicle accident? It's got to flip over a car. Who's got to run into a burning house? Who's going to do it? Who's mentally capable? And then who's physically capable? It's almost like a duty. Now I'm dealing with other people's lives too. If 
if I'm gonna build muscle, it's gonna be for a more important reason. I'm most proud of I built this machine and I'm putting it to good use.